how to set up teams, private gateways, and dedicated servers in Nordlayer Advanced slash Enterprise plans. Once you've created an account, organization, you can start adding members and assigning them to teams. This can be done before you even purchase a subscription plan, via the control panel, CP, on the Nordlayer website. In the team section, the owner can create various teams, assign and remove members, and manage their devices. To access the section, click Organization-Teams. To create your teams, 1. Click the Create Team button. 2. Enter the name of the team and click Create Team. To add members, 1. Click on a team you want to add a member to. 2. Click the Add Member to Team button. 3. Find the member by name or email and click Add Members. Note that you can add multiple members at once. To remove member from team, 1. Click on a team you want to remove a member from. 2. Click on a member you want to remove. 3. Click the X icon next to the team you want to remove the member from. To add team to gateway, 1. Click on a team you want to add to a gateway. 2. Click the Add to Gateway button. 3. Find a gateway, multiple options possible, you want the team to use, then click the Add Gateways button. Edit team's name, 1. Hover over the team. Click on the three dot icon and select the Edit Team option. 2. Alternatively, click on a team, and then click the Edit button. Delete a team, 1. Hover over the team. Click on the three dot icon and select the Remove Team option. 2. Alternatively, click on a team, and then click the Delete button. You can use a search field to find the team you need. The network is managed via the control panel, CP, on the Nordlayer website. There, the holders of the advanced and enterprise plans are able to set up private gateways and dedicated servers. Network gateways A private gateway connects a dedicated private server with the team it is assigned to. Each gateway can have one or more different servers with static IP addresses. Multiple gateways ensure better load balance and make it easier for you to grant your teams access to servers. In the gateways section, owners can create gateways and add teams and servers to them. To access the section, click network-gateways. To create a private gateway, 1. Click on the create private gateway button. 2. Enter the name of the gateway and click create gateway. To add team to gateway, 1. Click on the gateway you want to add a team to. 2. Click build team. 3. Search for a team and click add teams. To add servers to gateway, 1. Click on the gateway you want to add servers to. 2. Click add server. 3. Find a server and click add servers. To suspend slash activate gateway, 1. Hover over the gateway and click on the three dot icon. 2. Select suspend or activate. To change gateway's name, 1. Hover over the gateway and click on the three dot icon. 2. Select edit, enter a new name, and click save changes. To delete gateway, 1. Hover over the gateway and click on the three dot icon. 2. Select delete. Servers, a dedicated private server is a server you've purchased so your teams have their own dedicated IP address that only they can use. Dedicated servers can also be used for whitelisting IPS to access your remote resources and even setting up a site-to-site -site connection. You will need to buy a license for each of your dedicated servers. In case your resources, example load, decrease, the number of server licenses will need to be adjusted manually. In the server section, you can see a list of your dedicated IP servers with their IP addresses, gateways, and load information. To access the section, click network-servers. To delete a server, 1. Check the boxes next to the servers you want to delete. 2. Select the Delete option from the Actions drop-down. To add a server, please go to the Gateways section.